Hi everybody, good morning. This is Denise and today what I'm gonna share with you is about the H1N Zoom uh, recorder. I got it yesterday and I did some, you know, some trials and testings and at first I had a really really uh, big problem because of the, 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 the USB cable that I used um, can uh, carry the uh, electricity or the energy to the this is the the recording the recorder okay however um, it cannot detect audio I mean like if I want to use this as interface it just cannot detect it so um, I had to look for you know other cables the same thing and I was lucky that I found this I I'm just gonna share the link with you guys so if you want to buy this thing you better check the compatibility of the uh, the cable okay which cable you should um, use anyway and uh, this is what I'm using now and it is just perfect I really like it I immediately um, record it a, um, a video tutorial video yesterday and it was just perfect and of course I had to um, tweak some you know the EQ you know and uh, all these things to you know just reduce the noise compression and all these things you know set your microphone and that's it you're good to go and this is very easy okay as you can see I am this is the cable then uh, this one is the output so when I want to hear my voice, I can, you know, use my headset and that's it. Although I have a microphone here, but I have the opportunity to to unplug it. But if I want to use the microphone of my headphone, just have to plug it here. Input. Okay, so that's it. And what you are hearing right now is from H1N Zoom Recorder. And I think Zoom H1N is still the best, is still good to use for for recording uh, if you're in the field or even using it as an interface you know microphone uh, connected to your computer because I'm gonna use this for my tutorial and for my courses so that's it guys um, if you want to know anything else uh, it's really easy to use I think I showed that to you yesterday um, no sorry um, in the other part of the video and uh, it's just so easy once you once you turn it on this is here the part here oops it's not detecting the autofocus please okay I don't know why anyway uh, just turn it on and then you're good to go it will ask you audio or uh, what is that um, something you know just asking you if you want to connect it to your computer or what is that it audio or can't remember but it's just easy and then if you want to use it as bus or the battery and etc so it's really simple to use and uh, you know you just have to change the setting according to your preference you play around with it you know it's really handy it's small look as you can see i didn't even buy the kit yet i have this octopus stand and i just connected it there and it, boom i'm i'm ready to to record <laughs> it's just really good I, I'm happy with it it's just really nice so that's it thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time bye ciao